Thank How to dress girl. sexy. Oh, girl. My baby girls. <laughs> please. <laughs> your lingerie. <laughs> it has what to be it top in? notch. <laughs> you know, we're talking about food. We're talking about bra. We're talking about coffee. I have no idea what she's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> we're talking about the gather and the socks. Ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe my eyes. Hey guys, how you doing? You welcome back to my channel. My name is Nayarichi and this is still the Nayarichi show. If this is your first time of being on my channel, please kindly hit the subscribe button. Down. And Turn on the notification bell to see so I'll be getting more of my videos. If this is not your first time, you are welcome back. So today I have with me this beautiful girl. She's looking all sexy. <laughs> you know? Oh my god, this is all my name. She winds me at every moment. My name is Kimenendu. You can check out my YouTube channel. Okay, yeah. So I'm definitely gonna put her link in my description. <laughs> Whenever you're done watching this, kindly go over to her and watch because we're about to bring you an interesting and juicy dress. You know what I'm talking about? None of my business is none of my business. No. You have no idea, girl. They are no. You don't know about it. <laughs> it is what it, it is. is. <laughs> what the hell? It is what it is. It is, it is what it is. It is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we talk about let's get right into this video. Today we'll be talking about do's and don'ts of a healthy oh, relationship. relationship. And we're talking about no relationship, no friendship. We're talking about the real deal. Relationship, the real, mm -hmm. you know. What you shouldn't do in, in a, a relationship, relationship as a girl. As a girl, as this a girl, girl talk, mm -hmm. girl talk. <laughs> so, ladies, we're gonna be bringing, we're gonna be telling you what you should do and what you shouldn't do in a relationship to keep your relationship longer. Even to though sometimes your... some guys nothing have like you hardly please them. Anything you do, they'll still, you know. Mm. We don't know what the hell is going on right now. Mm. But then, this tips would definitely help you to grow your relationship. So, we tell my other, let's get right into this video. So, we have some tips written down here. We're going to be, you know, um, saying it out. Number, Number one, one do's. <laughs> now, ladies, you need to learn how to please your man. Mm. How to be sexy for your man. Okay, girl. Mmm. What are the tips to pleasing your man? Okay, breakfast in bed, girls. We have to do it like once in a while. Surprise, exactly. You're not you gonna know? be doing that every time because we, we don't have time. Because mm -hmm. the guy will get bored. Exactly. Sorry, so bored. these just like tips on how to please him. You know, surprise him at some point once in a while. Yeah, you know guess. this. Even if you don't want to cook, you can get all these like surprise breakfast packages for That's him. That's good. That's in good. In the morning, maybe he's been complaining about work. He's been complaining about this. And maybe you guys I'm don't have time. To, you know, to, probably like, to even, bond. Yeah. How to dress girl. sexy. Oh girl. My baby girl. Please, <laughs> your lingerie. <laughs> it has Put to it be top notch. <laughs> you know, we're talking about food. We're talking about bra. We're talking about. Coffee. I have no idea what she's talking about. <laughs> we're talking about the gather and the socks. Ah, ah. <laughs> I cannot believe my eyes. I'm you surprised know? when guys are done watching this. They're all gonna be looking for you. <laughs> Oh, no, no, no. Know and learn how to please your man because this man, please. you gotta please them. You gotta. Because they you always gotta. want to be pleased. Mm -hmm. You got to at least stroke the ego, you know? Okay. Yeah. Once in a while. That's a good, that's a good point. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to go ahead with the number one don't. Don't, don't be a housewife. Please or don't, don't act like a housewife to your man. You know what I'm talking about? Like you def you're definitely cooking for him every day. Mm. You're all sweeping the house. Mm. You're practically living with him. You're practically being in help. Don't do that. Don't Give do your that. man space. A lot of space, girl. A lot of space. I'll be, I'll and, and yeah, and yeah, it's good to take care of your man. It's good to it's very, no, it's do very all good. of it's that. Bad, like, like, but, take care of your man. Don't, uh -huh. <laughs> but don't exceed it. Know no. your boundaries. Know where to Please. stop. If okay. you are a single lady, so if you're a single lady mm -hmm. and you have your own apartment and your guy has your, his own apartment, yeah. at least you can do weekends. Yeah, that works definitely. Like you can do weekends. That would be that works best. definitely. But please don't act like a housewife. You're gonna, sometimes don't. it's going to be like a sea finish and they might just get tired already. Mm. So no, it's you know, not a sea finish. It, it is. And they're gonna so spice on. it up. Take care of your man for sure. But don't be a housewife because when you do that, they're going to look for another girl immediately. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Yes, girl. girl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> on to the next. 
Okay. Understanding, communication, and comprehension. I now, think that's very important too. Yes. Though. Now, in a relationship, I always tell people, first of all, like I said, you have to know your man. So know mm, what this is him of. Know what works everything. For him. So now, this is where communication sets in. Maybe you're talking with your man, yeah. trying to discuss something with him. You're like, baby, okay, I have a problem. Mm -hmm. You're communicating with your man. Very important. Mm. Yeah, okay. So now, after the um, communication, which you've spoken to your man, you mm -hmm. have a problem and everything. You move on to comprehension. Right. Now you're talking. Is the person you're talking to understanding what you're saying? Comprehending? Okay. Yeah, you have no. to. Exactly. Is he is he imputing it in his brain? Very important. As a girl, you need to know if your man is imputing. How you know? The language. language. Everything. Body language is very important, girls. Girls, listen to your man's body language. Yes. Communication, comprehension, and understanding. understanding really very important. That very. is almost like the major key. If you don't communicate in your relationship, I mean, what are you what doing, are you doing? Right? And if you don't understand too, if you don't understand your man and stuff like doing? that. So I, I believe you all know that tip already. So I'm gonna go ahead to the second don't. Second don't. don't be a <laughs> leash. Yeah. You know we ladies we love money a lot, you know. We do. I mean, who doesn't? I mean who doesn't? I mean Okay, I don't think I do. Man, I really man, don't. Man, mm -hmm. man, no. <laughs> <laughs> I always speak in Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't like to. I love money, but okay, yeah, I really this, we do love money and all, but it's a relationship. It's almost like a 50 50. Don't be a leech. No way to stop. Don't go overboard. You I know your man supports you. Definitely, your man should be able to support you in whatever you're doing. But no way to stop. You know, you're asking for money, but don't definitely do that like don't every time every day, because don't. he might just get. Angry. fed up and tired and it's gonna be like is this a reason that you're here so Maybe no way to i remember the video we need to talk about we need to do a video of how to ask your guys for money money <laughs> Ladies, watch out for that video we're gonna be giving you a exactly lot of tips on how to ask your man for money. money without them knowing yeah. number two tips don't be a leech and no way to stop End of story. Bring something to the table. Girl says you definitely have to bring something to the table. You need to bring something to the table. You mm -hmm. can't be allowing your man to do every single thing for okay. you. I always give an example. For example, I will use myself, I'm in a relationship. Mm -hmm. And I know this is what my man wants and this mm -hmm. is what my man does not want. A man loves a supportive lady uh -huh. if you're able to handle your man mm -hmm. and you're able to handle his work for him okay. like giving him advice financial advice exactly now this is where he'll be looking at it like ah, this girl is a boss all right she knows what she wants and she knows what she can do okay she knows what she can bring to the table don't be all relying and all of that don't be all relaxed in a relationship mm. give because we women are naturally intelligent yeah that's where I also said at some point it has to be 50-50. You might not have all the money, but you should always support your man. When your man brings the money, as she said at some point, you bring in your ideas too. And even coming come to money, your man doesn't have to spend 100% on you. No, at some doesn't. point, you have to take care of yourself too. At your point, you have to buy your hair, even though you my man has to buy my hair. <laughs> Mm, that doesn't make no sense. You know, we need this. Even though we have the money, we don't want you to buy all the stuff. A man definitely has to give us the money for that. He has to give us seventy percent of the money. We can't stop. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, her point is bring something to the table. There. Bring yeah. Like, like babes, you need to learn how to bring something to the table. You yeah. give, relationships is about giving and taking. It's so exactly right. It's all of you to feel. It's all of you to don't drown be all yourself. At the other side, in, don't all get you. Like, like give your man to so your mm -hmm. man can. Crazy. Okay, get into the number four. Don't, don't don't get too familiar with your guys' friends. Don't don't take it easy, girl. You upset. <laughs> Men already are you jealous. They are already jealous of you talking to a random guy or even being friends with a random guy. Talk more of their friends. friends. Uh. I don't know what it is for them, but definitely, as I said, this is for girls. We're coming to guys who are gonna. <laughs> slander and drag them out everything but girls try to know where to set the boundaries for your, your friend, friend, friends your, friends because your, i mean it even happens there are some stories when girls leave their man and do something pick up with their friends, friends you know that kind of a thing that. don't be caught in that situation mm -mm. because it's a girl code mm -mm. don't do that sis you know you what i'm talking about mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but but the thing is 
it's good to be friends with everybody. Yeah, sure, cool, but no, you know, you have to know your man. Mm. If your man is controlling, that is a no no. Uh, I don't want to talk about the characteristics, mm, that's a no no. But we're talking about the fact that you know your man and you guys are comfortable, good, but I mean, just don't get too comfortable with your friends' friends. So, coming to the end of this video, Woo! we have the last do's. Treat your man like a king. Oh. You need to treat your like in, you know how they treat it. You need to respect. I'm not saying you shouldn't do the ballet. <laughs> <laughs> no, just treat your man like a king when you wake up, greet him, yeah. treat him with respect. Like even in public, even in public, all, don't embarrass your man because they're almost all really proud. So they always <laughs> like all, all that proud. praises and all of that. So yeah, they like they like see. Anna, Rub your man's head. <laughs> <laughs> and all like the sugar daddy stuff. <laughs> what? To your man. Yeah, to your man. Okay. Not for the final. So I bet that was quite self explanatory. There is no much into it. Never bring in a third party into your relationship. Mm, that it's a never. That never. it is a dorm. Family, whatever. Oh, friend, oh, sister, mm -hmm. oh, cousin, don't bring them. Whatever that you're going through or any issue uprising, it's between the both of you. I yeah, believe you guys would be more comfortable talking. Um, talking about it. Even though you guys are in a heated argument or something, give space, then come back. But never bring in a third party because the third party might at the end. Huh? Mm, worse the whole mm, thing. It's not about. Mm -hmm. the, the yeah, worse the whole thing, especially if it's a third story. party girl that <sighs> it's actually eyeing your man. You know, this is like true life stories. Mm, they will, they will steal, they will take, <laughs> and they will chuck inside your pocket. So girls, be wise. Don't exactly. ever bring a third party. So although I wouldn't, I wouldn't really yeah, zero is in the sense that there are some people too, there are some friends that you can always tell. Oh, this is what happened. This is it. But <laughs> it's. From a distance, well, you know, you know, don't bring don't, them in. Don't, don't, bring don't, don't in. bring them in. Like, say, don't okay, bring them in. they want to settle World War One. World and World World then, World before World. anything, let me even um, add another one. That idea of you going out, you going out to see your man, and then you tag, you, uh, you allow yeah. your friends to tag along. No. <laughs> <laughs> Like don't do that! <laughs> don't do that! Even if you want to do that, tell, uh, tell uh, your uh, man to bring a lap man. Exactly. You can be don't like a that. double date. Double dating, so don't do that. Yeah. Oh, don't bring. Don't okay, 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 okay. I guess you're almost. Um, we are here. We are at the, <gasps> the end. end of the video. And one more thing here for the don't. I think the don't outweighs the dudes. So don't live with your man. Don't. Hey. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Why do you sound so personal? <laughs> Please, don't, ladies, don't um, leave it. Mm. It's it's it has caused more harm than no, good. Really, um, from experience, not from my personal experience, but from experience with friends, it has really caused more harm than good because that's where they call see finish. Your guy gets tired of seeing you when you guys are not married, though. And don't he do goes that. to other babies. Yeah, exactly. Ghost yeah. and come back. Don't come back. So do all his crew to see you again. Hey. <laughs> we have come to the end of this my yes video. talk shows video mm -hmm. and. I'm so happy she was able to host me in this video. I'm happy you came through, girl. <laughs> I'm so happy I was able to give my advice, and I yeah, hope I our hope advices go hope well. You from it, though, I hope you really learn from it because please. you're definitely learning from it, yes. and um, definitely you would learn from it. And please, if you have any other stuff, because of time, we wouldn't really finish this up. If you have other tips, do's and don'ts of a healthy relationship, please. Oh, um, kind of drop it in the comment section so that people that are also interested we'll also see. pick points from there. Well, so we come your way next time. Thank you guys.